Hey everybody, this is a quick video in case you have a Nokia Wi-Fi beacon. There are various different models, this works for all of them, and you need to do a hard reset to the factory default settings on it. Now you're going to want to do this for one of two reasons. The first one is troubleshooting. If this beacon is not connecting to the internet or your devices are not able to connect to it or detect it or any other kind of issues like that where it's lagging, it's not responding, stuff like that, it can very often be fixed with a hard reset to the factory default settings. Now you're going to need to set it up again because this everything will be wiped off of it and that's the second reason that you might want to do this. If for whatever reason you want to get this beacon back to the way it was when it came out of the box, we can go ahead and do this quite easily. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to need to find the reset button which is on the back of all of the beacons except for the beacon 6 which you'll find it on the bottom. So here it is on um, this one. So what you're going to do is you're going to make sure that the beacon is powered on and it's not, but nothing's plugged into it. Um, so powered on, nothing plugged into it and we're going to press and hold. You may need to use a paper clip or a pen and um, press and hold that button for about 10 seconds until the LED flashes red, at least twice it'll flash red. Um, and then you can let go and allow it to complete its, its reset and you'll know it's, it will be completed in its reset when the LED light will turn solid white indicating that it's booting up. Um, and then once it's booting up then it will flash yellow indicating that it's been factory reset and it's ready to be configured so that you can go ahead and set it up as a new device.